a stabbing on board an Amtrak train. Police in Niles, Michigan say Amtrak called them to say a passenger, Michael Williams, was behaving oddly. Our officers were dispatched up here and while they were en route, at some point the uh, male suspect on the train did assault at least four individuals on the train with a knife. It was a frightening scene. I look up and there's an African-American gentleman standing over somebody who's sitting down in one of the first seats in the car and I see him have his fist up and then I bring it down. Three passengers and a conductor were injured. Williams faces four counts of assault and a one million dollar bond. Across the country, Beverly Hills, California's Rodeo Drive saw an unusual scene as police shot a bank robbery suspect inside the Lux Hotel. Police pursued him into the hotel's lobby just after he robbed a nearby bank. In Connecticut, trial began for a woman accused of trying to have her ex-husband murdered. Tiffany Stevens is accused of paying her handyman, John McDade, $5,000 to kill her former husband. She talked about how much she hated him and what he had done to her and he had abused her and he had abused their daughter. Police say McDade has a recording of Stevens requesting the killing. A Tennessee man stole a hearse from a funeral home only to turn himself in just hours later at the police station, driving up in the hearse. I asked him to come get me in my mom's house and let me wear a bulletproof vest and they would not do it. They said, you got to do something to go to jail. And I didn't know what else to do. Police say Catherine seems to have mental issues and believes he's in some sort of trouble and wants protective custody.